Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to another vlog. It's Vlogmas Day. I was gonna say eight, but it's nine today, I think. I don't know. It's getting hard for me to keep track, and then I've been messing up my advent calendar, but it's day nine. And I am leaving to go to Seattle today, and I'm so excited. My flight isn't until later this evening. I have to go to the airport around like four ish. So I have pretty much all today to like get ready to go. I need to pack all of my stuff. I need to clean up around my apartment because I hate coming home to like a messy place. I actually just got home. I stayed the night at Brandon's last night and it's like 8.30 right now when I put on my workout set. I'm not having like a late start to the day. It's more just like a late start here because I woke up around like 6ish at Brandon's and I was cleaning up there and helping him. I like to just do his laundry and I don't do everything for him all the time but I just like to help when I can and when I'm there. So I just was like folding towels and darks and then I he was like doing dishes and stuff so his place is clean for him and I'm so glad that we put up his Christmas tree yesterday that is so exciting I need to get decorations or like ornaments for both of our trees because <laughs> mine has one ornament and then obviously his has none so I need to like look and actually get that all figured out it's nice that we at least have trees up to be in the holiday spirit this morning I'm gonna go do a workout just because I want to make sure that I get some movement in today and then for basically the rest of the day I'm gonna be getting ready to go on the trip I haven't had any of my like morning greens I usually drink chlorophyll water and stuff in the morning too but I am gonna go down to the gym like right away so I'm just gonna do my greens right now I usually just do like a cup of water I don't know if this is eight ounces but I would say like around eight ounces of water and then just one scoop of this I think I have another one but I'm almost done with this jar right here you can stir it with a spoon if you want but I got this frother on Amazon and I've actually had this for a long time I need to get another one because sometimes when I click the button it like doesn't turn on like I'm clicking it and it's like not doing anything it does work but yeah there we go it's kind of broken Today I'm just gonna do 12, 3, 30 and then upper body. My legs are still so sore from my workout the other day. It's definitely good to be sore. Like that's the goal of the workout is to actually feel it so that you know that you worked hard and you pushed yourself. But my calves are so tight just because I haven't really been doing any calf raises. I was gonna wear my AirPods Max, but they're dead. So I just plugged them in. I am so happy that I bought these. The sound quality is so good. I think that they are just like a really great pair of headphones. So it would be something good to ask for for Christmas or um, like treat yourself and get them. But I am happy that I bought them if you've been wanting like an update. got out of the shower I had a really good workout and I tried to film as much as I could but there was people in there and they were kind of looking at me and I felt a little awkward so I don't really know what footage I got but I did upper body shoulders like chest and tries and then I just um, washed my body I didn't need to wash my hair because I just washed it yesterday but I already washed my face and now I'm just gonna do some moisturizer because that's still like the only skincare that I can do right now I bought this moisturizer yesterday at, or was that yesterday no two days ago when I got the microneedling done my mom actually uses this brand of skincare and she loves it she's been using it for a while and always tells me that I need to try it and then when I was at my appointment I was asking Daisy what I should use and she recommended it to me too so I was like okay I definitely need to get it now but this is the trio rebalancing moisture treatment I still have some of the serum left so I technically don't need to use this yet but I just want to try it and see the bottle is actually so pretty like I love the gold on it I need to do the advent calendar of the day and today is December 8th this one is so good I got the Elta MD skin recovery essence toner and actually didn't buy is this focusing 
Um, I actually didn't buy a toner when I got my skincare products just because everything costs so much money and I technically didn't need to get this, but I definitely do like having a toner just because you use it after you wash your face and it helps to like clean your skin. I always get dressed with the tags still on and I really should take them off beforehand. That wasn't that bad, but sometimes the sweatshirts are hard. This is like perfect for traveling and for packing and stuff because it's comfy. I'm gonna wear it with the waistband rolled all the way just because they're a little big. I think it'll probably be better when I wash it because it will shrink up a little bit. Need to make my coffee and I'm gonna do gingerbread house mug today. boyfriend like long sleeves t-shirts and the like boxer shorts and skims was doing a sale over black friday but i ended up just buying them from nordstrom because the ones on sale were final sale and i don't want to get something if i can't return it just in case the size isn't right so i just ordered it from nordstrom because it's easier for me to return but i got the boxer shorts in black in a size double extra small and then i also got them in an extra small just to see what's better and then in next time skims does a sale i can order it from them the black actually wasn't on sale they had a chocolate brown that was like really cute but just to be safe i got black from nordstrom and i'll try them so these are an extra small i also got the tops so i got a black long sleeve and i love this it's super soft i ended up getting this in a size medium a lot of people get this in like a medium or large just so that it can be oversized and i was debating on what to get but i went for a medium because i didn't want it to be too big and then i also got a black short sleeve just because i thought i could wear them both with the boxer shorts the sweatpants that i bought like the joggers were the boyfriend fit but they didn't have an extra small in stock in the color that i got so i ended up getting a different style i love their holiday bags i think they're so cute and i've been meaning to mail the other ones back i still need to do that i probably have time this afternoon actually but I got the mega style so these ones are like a little bit more high rise and they're still like the joggers that cinch on the feet I think that these will be better and this is perfect timing because I can bring this set with me if these fit right but I think that these will be good I actually like the way that these fit so much better just because they're more high rise and I think they look more flattering they also just like stay up better and I don't have to use the tie to like cinch them or anything I am so happy that I ordered these in a two extra small because this is the extra small and look how big the waist is on me like huge so I'm definitely gonna be keeping the two extra small and then this is the long sleeve I like this because it's like a little bit oversized it covers like my butt that's exactly what I wanted I could have gotten the shirt in a small that would still have been probably oversized I'm glad that I didn't get a large because that would have been just too big in my opinion I'm starting to pack and I've been trying to think of outfits that I want to wear whenever I go on a trip I like to plan specific outfits as opposed to just like grabbing a bunch of clothes and throwing it into a bag because I want to make sure that stuff actually looks cute together I took out a pair of black boots just because because I know that I'm gonna want to wear like a cute outfit for dinner one night or maybe a couple nights and I also try to bring things that I can mix and match just because I don't want to completely overpack I already bring too much in general like I'm so good at way overpacking but I definitely do like try to be mindful of it for the black boots I think I'll probably just do like some dark denim I also want to bring a pair of light denim. I could do 
this one or I could do this one. My A Goldie jeans are like my absolute favorite. I think I want to do this pair. So I'm going to grab that. And then I also was thinking about bringing these like black cargo pants. I wore these recently and I just really like them. They're a good casual pant to have. So I'm going to grab those. I'm going to be there for like six days and I'll want some outfits for during the day and then some for evening. So I think that three pants will be good. I definitely want to bring this. I am obsessed with this fleece. I showed you guys it in the Aritzia haul. These sell so fast, so I don't know if it's in stock, but I have it in this color and then you guys have seen in the like light tan, but it's so warm. I know it's going to be really cold there, so I have to bring like long sleeves, long pants, a lot of jackets. I'm going to grab all of these things for now. Basically, when I go on a trip, <laughs> I feel like the easiest thing for me is to just grab like clothes that are new that I am excited to wear. I'm like, well, I just got all these mostly, so I'm going to bring them. <laughs> I just grabbed this mirror because I want you guys to see some of the outfits that I've been styling and I don't want to be running back and forth into my office. But anyways, for this first outfit, I was kind of thinking it would be cute to do a blazer with the dark jeans and I like the look of like different grays together. And then I have my black booties on and just this white t-shirt this is from aritzia so this could be cute for like a dinner night and i'd probably do like my white bag just to like tie in the white t-shirt this is a cute day outfit i thought i could wear this to like brunch or if we go shopping or something and just put this brown leather jacket on with a black turtleneck and then these black pants at first i tried them on with my platform uggs but i actually like it with the taz ones better just because you can see like the red stitching since they like cinch i just wanted to show you guys one option of styling the outfit a little bit differently so what i could do is i could use the same top and pants i might do a like um lower neck black long sleeve just like a plain one but you guys get the idea so i could do the blazer with it in the pants and then instead of the um ugg slippers i could do some air forces and then my white bag so using like the same pieces of clothing but just like styling it a little bit different next outfit idea is just this fleece with some blue jeans and i like this color of denim with this top as opposed to the lighter wash that i have and also these jeans only have one hole whereas the other ones have two and i just think that these ones will be a little bit warmer same jeans and air forces but i did this black leather trench coat and then basic long sleeve shirt from aritzia and i was also thinking that if i end up doing something in the evening where i need to dress up i could just put my black booties on the ones that are over there and then it would dress up the outfit a little bit more this is another outfit with the jeans and the sneakers i just put a like white t-shirt that i brought and then this green jacket i love this coat it's so warm and i think that this would be a good one to bring so this is another outfit idea with like the same stuff just because i'm really trying not to like bring way too much clothes with me i want to have stuff that i can mix and match so i really do try to like bring good staples that are mostly plain so they look good with a lot of things i have all of my potential outfits laid out and then i also grabbed two different sweatsuit sets just to have for like lounging in and also if we do some coffee runs. And then I grabbed my jumpsuit, this black one that I got from Aritzia because I also think that that would be cute to throw on. That's like a majority of the clothes that I'm gonna bring. I need to grab my like socks, underwear, pajamas, and then I have the shoes right here. So I'm just gonna bring my Air Forces, black boots, Taz Ugg slippers, and then I'm gonna wear the platform ones on the plane. I was thinking about bringing this black puffer just because it is warm. I got this one from Zara and it's really cute, but I'm not sure if I'll have space. So I just have that off to the side because I'm undecided on that. I just went and grabbed my suitcase. I have like a storage closet on my balcony. So I leave all my luggage in there and I really need to get a new suitcase because this one is like cracked. There's like a big crack right here and then also one of the wheels are broken so i've been wanting to get the base luggage i am obsessed with that suitcase and the brown color that they have is so pretty i used this suitcase when i studied abroad so it just 
went to so many different countries and got very banged up. But I'm going to use it today because I need to check a bag. I have all my packing cubes in it and I love using these to put all my stuff in. Or There's only three. There should be five or maybe I have four. I don't know. There's one more I know for sure and it's probably in my closet. But I'm going to start with putting my shoes in here and then I need to get all the clothes. I'm really excited to go though and I'm going to have so much fun hanging out with Lauren and seeing her. If you guys don't know, Lauren is my best friend that I went to college with. So I grew up in Seattle and I went to the University of Washington. I graduated in 2019, but if any of you guys went to UW, then go dogs. I know some of you are from Seattle and have gone there and watched my videos, and I had such a fun time when I was in college, but I joined a sorority my freshman year, and when we were doing recruitment the following year, that's when I met Lauren because she is one year younger than me. I actually talked to her during recruitment and the second I talked to her, I was like, she is so cute. I'm obsessed with her. I love her personality and I want her to be my best friend. <laughs> and then she ended up joining my sorority, which I'm a G5. I don't know if I said that or not yet. A couple months later, she became my little. So when you're in sororities, you have like big and little. I am so happy that we've stayed so close, even though I moved away. Also, she has a little named Sienna, and um, Sienna's gonna hang out with us this weekend too. Like we're still all like really close, and we have so much fun together. And I feel like I can really be myself when I'm with them, and just be silly and have fun. So we'll, we'll all probably get dinner on Saturday night, or we'll get brunch together on Sunday. But it's gonna be a lot of fun. So I'm gonna finish packing up and get everything into my bag. I need to grab like my other clothes. I also need to grab workout clothes because I forgot that. Just about finished packing and I got one more package in the mail that I'm really excited about. I got some new cases from Casetify and I always like bringing a couple phone cases with me just because sometimes I like to match my outfits with them. I got this black one and then I love this green print one. I think it's so cute. And then I also got this like plain clear one and then this one I customized and I put Baby Hay on it. But I am obsessed with their cases. They're so good. I'm officially all packed up and ready to go. Brandon is actually picking me up and taking me to the airport. And he said that he just got here. So I will see you guys when I get to Seattle. I finally made it to Lauren's and look how cute it is with her little Christmas tree. I feel like the spotlight is really on me right yeah. here. Yeah, I got your <laughs> studio lighting set up for you. I love it. You guys, I have a situation. My bag did not make it on the plane with me. <laughs> and I don't even know how that happened because I went to the bag check, I checked my bag, and then when I got off the plane, I was like waiting at the carousel for so long, and then everyone got their bag, and I didn't get my bag. <laughs> and so I brought my like bag tag to the front, and they said that they accidentally put my bag on the later flight, so it's not getting here until like, I don't even know, midnight maybe? Which is really annoying. Thankfully though, I do have a pair of pajamas with me. I threw my Skims pajamas into my duffel bag, just, just cause. 
So I have pajamas, if anything. But we just went to PCC and got some snacks because I'm hungry. Also, say hey hi. guys, we're back. We're back. I got so many snacks because I'm you were just starving. Like, you didn't even like have a basket. You're just like, yep. Yeah, yeah, I'm like, yep, oh, no, 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 this will be good too. So I got some crackers, the Simple Mills almond flour ones, and some hummus, which I thought this looked good. It's a garlic and lemon one. That combo is amazing. I've never had this brand before. Me either. I didn't know what to get. I just like randomly grabbed one. And then I also got a yogurt, my favorite yogurt. I'm craving this. I've been eating these at night, like as a snack. Yeah. So I just got one for tonight. And then I also got this granola. I actually saw in Danielle Carolyn's video that she loves this Purely Elizabeth brand. So I just decided to get that. And then I got some fruit to go on top of it. Just this like berry medley that has strawberries, ra raspberries, and blackberries. And then I got a banana. Also got some <laughs> organic mango, just the unsweetened one. Also got a coconut water. And then the last thing is this chocolate. Because I've been loving this. But this time I got the hazelnut butter dark chocolate. I've actually never tried this one before. Did they have a lot of flavors there? Did you see? Yeah, they did. They had like dark chocolate. They had the salty one. Almond butter. Wow, I've never seen those there before. Really? Yeah. But yeah, they had a bunch. Okay, my whole time. <laughs> Um, a little less intense than that, but also some mangoes. Haley copied me. I did. Some <laughs> pineapple and an orange olipop. I was really feeling the orange yellow. Yeah, what? I should have got an olipop. So, but don't they have um, you stevia don't, in them? You don't like them. You've tried them. You don't like them. I know. Every time I try to get myself to like it and I just don't. Don't you like not like carbonated things? I really don't. See, oh. I love a crisp <laughs> carbonation. So I got this instead. So now we eat. I know. What do I want right now? Now we feast. Do you have a bowl? No. <laughs> Sorry. Yes, I have a bowl. I need to eat my yogurt. That's for sure what I need. Well, oh, you're going to have some cream barrel? Mm-hmm. I love yeah. these ones. You're going to have to eat it with your hands, though, because I don't have any spoons. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wait, what? Do you want a big spoon or a little spoon? Um, I'll take little. Close it. It's good. I really like it. It's a lot. Okay, just <laughs> How delicious my yogurt parfait is. This isn't carbonated? I love your coffee table setup right here. Wow, thanks. And new anthro candle. Mm-hmm. Cute. Can I tie your stompers? Mm-hmm. They're so funny. I know. Go walking. Oh my gosh, they literally like little hooves. <laughs> they're so comfy though. Wait, they're so comfy. Mm -hmm. What size did you get? Five. Aren't they fun? I love you who. I know, right? <laughs> they are fun. They're so tall. I can't believe we even got them because they were back ordered till December. Jeez. And then they just came right away. So did you get them from the other book set? Yeah, I did. I saw them on StockX for resale for $350. Oh, nice. I was like, are you kidding me? Literally absurd. It's 1 a.m. Just got my bag. Better late than never. So, closing out the vlog. Love you guys. <laughs> See you tomorrow.